your front door. I told my amigo that I need some more pounds. A hundred peas, nigga, ain't enough to pass around. Don't need the skulls, cause ain't no peas getting buzzed down. I win Cartier off the grounds, real bust down. Your bitch love when I take it a pound town. I turn around, bust on the face and beat her down. That pussy too wet and make mac and cheese sound. I get her off the Casamigo, then I dick her down. I'm in the valley in Cali. Need a bitch freaky like sexy. She just said she wanna sex me. Uh, I don't like the bitch, I'm just a flirt. I told she go crazy, bitch, you can go berserk. That ass too fat, I had to fuck her off a perk. I told her I love her when she throw that ass, go ahead and twerk. I just a town with a hundred pounds. My bowl's green, y'all shit be brown. I got the Zaz and I got the lows. Come tap in, I got the shit on the blow. Pound town, just left pound town. I get them in and I get them out. I got it, uh. So that's how you coming in? So I'm coming, man. Real talk. So I'm coming. Straight out, you know. I just really on some like I really was gonna come on my own song, but like on my story, I had dropped it back there like two days ago and like it went crazy. Like it was the most like reaction I ever got. It got like a hundred and some votes. So I'm mm. like, oh all right, all right, yeah. that's what they want. All right, I might take it to famous animal then because I'm going to famous animal this weekend. Real talk. I know you was gonna turn me up. Real like, talk. Yeah. Nah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Pound Town. That's the name of it? Yeah, Pound Town Trap Version. Yeah, Trap Version. Trap Version. Yeah, you, know, for the, you know, it's going crazy in the streets for the females. And I know that, that I can catch right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know the niggas tired of hearing it. So it's like, they like, oh, when I give them that, they're like, oh, I can bump to that. They yeah. don't want to sing the girl version. Right, so, so you hear yeah. that, you're like, oh, yeah, I can bump to that. Yeah, real tough. it's hard. They beat hard. Yeah. I give it to Sexy Red. Shout out to Sexy Red because they beat hard. Like, yeah. Has she Red. reached out to you yet? Nah, uh, hopefully this, you feel me? Yeah. Like, I, maybe, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Remix. It's real uh, tough. Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let's get it. I work with you, man. Let's go. Oh, definitely. Real tough. So, like, you be writing your shit or you freestyle? Freestyle. All right, so really, I'm going to give you a scoop. I just started rapping. All right. I dropped my, or I got in the booth for the first time in December last year. I dropped my first song January twentieth. So this I'm, year, this year, I am. Yeah, yeah. So like, I'm really just free. I'm punching in. That's what my people tell me. They punching. say I'm punching in. Yeah, yeah. So like, yeah, I guess it's freestyling. Mm -hmm. Every now and then, like, I go in there, say something, come out the booth, write a little bit. I guess that's writing. I don't know. You feel yeah. me? I'm just really, yeah. It's kind of like punching in. Yeah, but I don't write nothing. I go yeah. in there, listen to the beat, and then play with the beat, like at the mic, like real talk, for real. For real. Yeah, so like, what got you into this rap shit? Like, you just into it. Like, what you seeing rappers and shit come through the hood? What is it motivating? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. Where I'm from, all right, so like, I, and we're out here, like where I'm originally from, it's none of that. But even now, Raleigh. Now, all right, so I'm originally from this city called Clinton. It's like an hour away mm. from here. But I've been in Raleigh since like middle school. So, like, don't get me wrong, Raleigh like made me, you feel me? But like, Clinton, my hometown. Mm. Like, you feel me? But where I'm from in Clinton, it's none of that. Like, no, none of that. Going none on. of that yeah, going on. Not yeah, even yeah. no studios, none of that going on. Even yeah. Before. Out here, though, it's a little hope, but, like, it's no rappers that made it, none of that out here. So, like, what really got me into it, though, is, like, just I'm a hustler, bro, and, like, I'm just, like, bro, I'm trying to find a way to make some. I, really, it's like I see a bunch, it's money in it, to mm, be honest with you. Yeah. To be honest with you, I see it's money in it. Everywhere I go, everybody like, bro, you need to rap, you need to rap. I be around, I got rapper friends. Are they like, saying this because you got the ice, the car, nah, and shit like that? funny. I just, all right, so I, I have changed, but, like, I, I bought the watch and all that just because I'm about to start rapping. Like, I could have been bought a bunch of jewelry, but, like, I had little little trophies, you know, because you're mm -hmm. hustling, like, reward myself. But, like, it was just because, like, my image, like, don't get me wrong. Yeah, I'm a flashy dude, I guess, but, like, yeah, my image. They saying you popping it. They're yeah. like, nigga, you need to rap. Yeah, <laughs> like, 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 the way I live. Like, yeah, I'm always traveling. You got that lifestyle. Like, yeah, like, 
fast cars in the club, popping bottles. Like, for real, for real, I was getting paid to come to the club before I even dropped the song. Like, I was getting paid to host parties. Like, just because you had a nine yeah, and just because of my name. Like, people come to the come to the club just because, oh, show out going to be in the club? Oh, we know it's going to be lit. Like, mm-hmm. type stuff. And so it's like, it's made sense. Like, all right, if I rap, I can make more money because now I got a catalog, I got a value to my name. Like, yeah, let's just, let's just do it. Like, oh, that's for real, for real. Real talk. So, like, I heard you say, like, the, the part where you really from, I know Riley made you the part, but where you really from, ain't no studios, none of that shit. None of that. So by representing you saying you coming from there, do niggas be like, oh, that nigga lying, that nigga No, 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 nah, because nah, I'm from there, like, nah, okay. been back and forth still, like, I got land there right now, like, you feel me, like, my people still stay there, like, all my, only like my my mom, my, my grandma stay in Raleigh, all my other family, cousins, everything, everybody, like, just me and my brother up here, all my mm. other family in Clinton, like. Everybody I'm cool with up here, I call my brothers, but they're not really my family. All my family really in Clinton. Mm. So it's like, nah, like, they know what's up. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I talk. Yeah. Oh, definitely, oh, definitely. Have you um, ran into any rappers and shit doing this shit? You know what I'm saying? You want to link with and collab with? Or did any music with? Yeah, all right, so what's crazy is, like, shout out to my dog, S.E.Y. Jim. He out of, um, on um, Florida. I don't want to say the wrong city. Yeah, I know you're talking about uh, Florida. Sign the QC. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So what's yeah. crazy is I've been my manager, like, he was like, all right, we need to get you a feature. I had, like, four songs in. I've been rocking with Jim, like, before he, like, even blew up. I was just a fan of bro, you feel mm. me? So I'm like, Jim, like, you feel me? This is before he even had the QC. I'm like, bro, he going to be next. Like, he he working his move. He working. He dropping. He doing streams. Like, I'm even listening to him all the way in North Carolina. Like, Bump for him. Yeah, you feel me? Ain't nobody else. I'm like, come on, bro. I know he next. We went, we got the feature, come at home, two, three days later, we see QC. Like, Sign. Now they talking about him. Oh, okay. Like, like, like they post him, like, oh, yeah, yeah, he hard. I, I post him. People listen to his music. I told my manager, like, yeah, I told you, like, look, he about to go. Two, three days, two, three weeks later, he pulled up on him, signed him, like, oh, yeah, boom. That was perfect. Like, mm. you feel me? That was my dude. Like, he was real. Like, you feel me? Pulled up. Jimmy, dude, we knocked the feature out. We was chilling all day. Like, you feel me? Pulled up, like, one o'clock. We could have been inside the future. We went and got food, all types oh, of like, shit. Like, it was cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I rocked with Brad. Then Wiz, you feel me? I was I did a song with Bro too. He on my tape too. What you know? He I had really opened up for Bro in um Daytona, Florida at um Diamond Dog, some club like that. You feel me? But it was like it was on some like really Jim kind of helped me out, his manager. You feel me? Like we was out there and and we was talking about like upcoming rappers, and I was telling like, y'all rock with Wiz, da da. They were like, why you out here? You might as well work your move. You really see it, die, 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 You feel me? And he, he looked out. He pulled up. Got down. Looked out. We knocked it out. Boom. Came back two weeks later. We told him we was doing the show. Came back, did the video. And like, so, but as far as like big rappers, like nah, like people that I really want to work with, like big, big famous people, it's like nah, not yet. Like I'm still. I'm who you want to work? Who who would you say you put some shit? That, who you can work with? Or put some shit together? Some decent music together with? Like it's gonna big, sound. Big. Yeah, it's gonna sound crazy, bro. But I'm trying to work with like. Lil Baby, like, no cap, like, 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 I, I, I went, then I want to get in the lane, like, like, on the, the other lane, too, like, I want to work with, like, like, well, he locked up now, but I, ain't, I was a fan of Bankroll Freddy, like, you know, I was Bankroll a big Freddy. fan of, I used to turn on every day, R.P. Dolph, I always Dolph? wanted to work with Dolph, bro, like, I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> that, that was my shit. role model, bro, yeah. like, I always wanted to work with Dolph, bro, R.P. Dolph, like, so Key Glock, I work with Key Glock, like, like people like that, like for real, for real, that's really who I want to work with. I want to be like, and what's crazy is like when I first started, I told everybody like I ain't even trying to be big in this. Like I'm just trying to get some money and go about go my way. Mm-hmm. So if, if you was to get some money at this shit right now, you would take the money and go do something else with it. Now, nah, try to continue to do it. I like it. Like I'm really actually starting to enjoy it. Like, I'm having fun with it. Like I'm getting paid. Yeah, like, it's, like, oh, it's actually working. Like you know what I'm saying. So it's like. Now I probably won't. I, I'll probably keep going and just see how far I can go with it. For real, for mm, real. Real talk. Most definitely. Most definitely. So, like, far as, you know, um, uh, okay, but far as, you know, like, uh, doing the movie, you got to be out to the drugs, the perk or some shit? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. All right, so when I first started, I don't even, I don't do perk, none of that. Yeah. Uh, nobody around me, we don't do none of that. We ain't mm. going for none of that. Don't pop no pills around me. We ain't going for none of that. I don't let niggas pop perks around me. Nah, you, you gotta get on. Yeah. You gotta get on. We don't go for none of that. Real but talk. like, don't get me wrong, I need a little weed, but not really like, I did at first when I started going to the studio, I always needed liquor. I ain't gonna cap. My niggas used to clown me, like, bro, why you need liquor? But it was because like, I was trying something new, you feel me? So I had to get, uh, get comfortable, vibe, like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, 
So that's really, but now though, like, bro, what's crazy is, bro, I can make a song. Bro, when I first started, it was taking me like an hour, hour, 30 minutes. I can go make a song in 30 minutes now, 20 Please. minutes now. Yeah, it'd be This crazy. shit gonna be hard though? Bro, I play some, <laughs> I'm gonna play some shit for you before I get out of here. Nah, for real. It'd be hard. Like, really, I got, what's crazy is I got like, I'm like 60, 70 songs in. Like, for real, for real. It was hard for me to choose my tape. I only put 12 songs out. He made me drop. My manager made me drop. Like he like, nah, you gotta drop, you gotta drop. I'm like, nah, I wanna keep giving them singles. Cause I'm thinking one of the singles I got, you know, people blow up a single. Yeah. You no, know, I'm like, you're like, nah, give him a take, give him a take. You got too many, too many hard songs. But when we went listen, it was hard to decide even the, what songs to put up there. Mm. What 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 would you say the hardest jump on the tape? If they listen to this song, they'll listen to the whole tape down there to see what else on it. Hmm. Feature or solo? Either one. What you bump? What you go to first when you click on? I ain't gonna lie. What you know going crazy in the streets. What you know? But I got a song out there called Tap In. Everywhere I go and I play that song, they go crazy. Like, they go crazy to that song. All that. All that. They go crazy. Like, it be it messes me up sometimes when people be singing. I be like, man, I don't know. You listen to it? Like, you know it already? Like, so, like, really tap in what you know. But then a, a solo song... Myself, out in Houston. If you really go listen to out in Houston, I was talking and popping my shit. I'm going to give you a little insult real quick. I went to Houston for my first time two, three months ago. Lost some lame-ass niggas scoped the Airbnb out, broke in that crib. Damn. So, when so they seen you out, what followed you back to the Yeah, it was with me and a couple of my boys. Like I think they seen us. We went shopping and shit that day. You know, we got jewelry on. They seen us coming out the crib. We went to his birthday was that night. Went to the club that night. Come back three, four o'clock in the morning. The crib and broke into. Broke into. Got child shit. You got, but they didn't even take everything. They just took like little money, took little designer stuff, the shopping bag, shit like that. You mm. think? As soon as I got back home, went to the studio. Made a song. About Made a song about that. The guy was talking cold cash shit. So you uh-uh. rapping about real life shit? Yeah. Anything I rap about, straight facts. Like I really don't. That's what's crazy. Like I go through so much stuff, and I be going. That's really why the music helped me. Like. I go through so much stuff, I use the music like that's what I rap about. Like anything I went to if I rap went to the studio yesterday, I rapped about what happened in the last week or two. Mm. Like that. Like that's why mm. I really be going. We are talk. Not to, to get too deep into it, but if a nigga go listen to your music, they can know what's going on. They're gonna know what's going on. Mm. Big heavy motion, they gonna know what's going on. <laughs> they gonna know where I'm from. They're gonna know about my bros. They're gonna know about my past, what I've been through. Them twelve songs, they're gonna listen to them twelve songs, they're gonna know. Straight from the top, where I've been from, where I've been at, what I've been through, everything. Like, what I got going on, what I really do, where I came from. Like, oh, blood, yeah. sweat, and tears behind anything I put in. Like, anything I do. Real talk. So what made you go with 12 songs? You know, some people put five, six, seven. You know, what made you go with 12? And you a new art. Like, it was too new old coming He artists. told me to do eight. Mm. AP, he told me to do six songs, eight songs, AP. I'm like, bro, I got too many fire songs. Mm. Too many, bro. I got too many. I got to give them at least 12. Come on, man. I got to give them <laughs> some trap, some soft, some for the girls. Okay. And that's what I all gave them. Like, you know, it's really all, everything up there, you're going to get a vibe from me. Everything up there is a vibe. Like, from one to 12, it's different vibes from each one of them. Like, you, whatever type of person you is, you're going to at least grab to one of them songs. I ain't gonna hold you up, but like, how did you get your name? How did they start calling you? What's crazy is for my brother, my older brother. Uh, my older brother he used to have his car club called Show Out Entertainment. With cars and shit? Yeah, he used okay. to have like dunks. You know, okay, with, yeah, out of schools of cars. With the 26s and all that. I mean, his bro used to do that. I was like eight or nine, bad kid running behind them. He just called me Little Show Out because he was the owner of it and he was it was show out entertainment they used to call me little show out, little show out. Yeah, okay like, yeah you'd be running around bad stuff, and like, shit yeah like and then it was like when i got older started getting a little money started popping it like everything i do i step and i do it to the fullest like to the max like mm. i show out basically so yeah. it like fit me like for real for like everything i do i'm gonna go all the way in go all the way in i'm gonna do it Put it in your face. I'm gonna pop it. <laughs> right. You follow me on Instagram. You gonna love it because I'm, I'm I'm gonna motivate you. You living it, right. and I'm really living life. Like, I'm yeah. living life. I right. I'm really living it. Real talk. Real talk. By the way, what's your Instagram and shit so they can keep up with you? CEO show out with two T C E O S H O W O U T T. Follow me on all platforms. You can stream my new debate, new debut mixtape. All hustle, no luck. 
out right now on all mixtapes. Mm-hmm. One to twelve. I got SCY Gym out there. I got Wiz having out there. I got Kasim out there. And I got Chorus Too Cold out there. Shout out to all of them. Yeah, Shout out to all of my producers. They helped me put all Thanks. this together. I'm really just getting started. I'm only 90 days in, but I'm telling y'all, I got to tap in. You got that hot shit. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, I'm telling you. Come on, now y'all got to tap in. Y'all go fuck with my boy, man. Y'all hearing this shit from the hottest shit in the streets. Let's go. Appreciate you.